Well, breaking news this morning, a bizarre Friday morning at the 2024 PGA Championship here in Kentucky. The number one golfer in the world right now, Scotty Scheffler, arrested and detained. Farron Foster has the following story and this morning, and I'll tell you, it has been crazy. Farron, what happened? Well, Doug and Lisa, Dylan and I have been following it. We broke it this morning on Good Morning Kentucky. This is the mugshot of the number one golfer in the world right now, Scotty Scheffler, just released moments ago. Scheffler has been charged with assault of a police officer, criminal mischief, reckless driving, and disregarding traffic signals from an officer directing traffic. So, how did we get here? It all started around 5 a.m. this morning. Louisville police responded to the scene in the 15,000 block of Shelbyville Road of a man that was hit and killed by a shuttle bus, which caused a traffic backup to Valhalla Golf Club just hours before the second round of the PGA Golf Championship when it was set to begin. Well, then Scheffler, thinking he was going to, you know, make his way there, attempted to drive past police and around the traffic jam. Well, that's when a police officer attempted to stop his car by attaching himself to the car and screaming at Scheffler to get out of the car. Scheffler was then pulled out of the car and put into handcuffs. Well, the start time has been delayed by an hour and 20 minutes, and Scheffler's tea time is now scheduled for 10.05 a.m. Word on our word into our newsroom moments ago is that Scheffler just, uh, he actually was released on his own reconnaissance, and he actually just arrived to Valhalla Golf Course. Uh, now, Louisville police, we do know they have had some problems in recent years, particularly in the death of Breonna Taylor years ago, where there was an actual investigation into police practices of the Louisville Police Department. There are reported rumors now coming out of ESPN and the PGA where uh, because of this morning's incident, the PGA uh, were hearing that they will evaluate whether or not they will return for another championship at Valhalla. Of course, we will keep you updated right here on ABC 36 News Now. But Doug, Lisa, what a morning it has been for sure. It sure has yeah. been, and Farron, we appreciate you tracking this all for us. A uh, complicated situation. Oh, it really and, is. And uh, continuing to evolve here. We're going to be talking about this for some time.